Last weekend, I rebuilt YouTube's home screen using just Swift UI. I looked at the current setup, I kept what I liked, and I got rid of what I disliked. I looked at other apps, how they're set up, and I organized my YouTube feed in a way that makes sense for my viewing preferences. There are certain things that I like, and I wanted to see them uh, become a reality with my YouTube home feed. And I filmed all of it. So here's what happened. Enjoy. Hey guys. Hey, it's me. Uh, if you're wondering what this red thing on my forehead is, I got sunburnt and it's peeling and it looks like I got punched in the face. So you can deal with that uh, because I'm stuck dealing with it. Anyway, it is Friday night, 9 p.m. and I'm not out. I'm not, I'm not partying. You know what I'm doing? Nothing. But I'm, I, I decided I'm gonna stay up however long it takes tonight and I'm gonna build something. So I'm scrolling through YouTube the other day and every option I had was just meh. Like I like them and it's custom to me, like the algorithm works for me, but like there wasn't a video that I could, I spent too much time scrolling and I'm not here to fix the algorithm. YouTube does a great job. If a YouTube employee sees this, okay, this is constructive criticism, all love. But uh, if I could re redesign their, the home feed, uh, this is what I would make it look like. This is my uh, YouTube feed as of a few hours ago. At the top here, you see that we have these categories and I never use this. I never hit explore, I don't like that. And then we have shorts across the across in the middle of the feed and I know YouTube is trying to promote that but they have a tab down here for shorts alone so if I'm in the mood to to TikTok it up to shorts it up let me just click that I don't want this in my feed uh, at least not that soon right so you have video video and it's just a jumble of categories and I want it to be you know just more organized and I know I can use those options at the top and also, does anyone even ever click like that casting button at the top? Or am I just a loser? I've never hit that. And I barely hit the notifications one, unless someone with a public profile subscribes to me or comments, to which I say, thank you, kind sir or madam. I don't like the jumbled at the top. I think library here on the right, um, Maybe my profile picture should be with that right tab. I feel like, you know, Facebook, Instagram, I'm cool with library being mixed in with like my stuff. Maybe that should just say like me and then library can be an option on that, on that right tab. But I would change a lot. The top feels jumbled and uh, I was looking for inspiration and here's what I found, okay? ESPN Plus, here's a quick walkthrough of what the ESPN Plus feed looks like. Now, we got two tabs across the top, not overwhelming, and the logo's in the middle, which allows you to space out those icons, which I really like, okay? We have the live across the top because that's what's important for ESPN Plus. I don't think that's necessarily important for YouTube, but maybe this is like your top recommended. But I love the use of horizontal scroll views here. Um, you can organize this by channel, by length. You have top picks, upcoming. You know, these will be different categories, but the UI here is pretty much exactly what I'm looking for. And then you have sports. So if you were to select sports, it takes you into a whole new screen. You got leagues, conferences, and then it goes back into here. So I'm thinking like sort by length. You can go like full podcast episodes. You can do like recommended from your subscriptions, because we do have a subscriptions tab. We don't want to interfere with that. And we could say like, uh, recommended outside of your pres uh, prescription. What are we, medicine? Outside of your subscriptions, like channels that you're not subscribed to, like new channels or whatever. And then you could do like above 20 minutes, below 10 minutes. I, I really want to use this as my inspiration. We're not going to get too crazy here. I just want to, uh, explore this idea of reorganizing 
YouTube's feed. So, so yeah, that's it. That's the approach. Um, I have a screenshot of my feed that I'm going to kind of go off of, but hey, uh, you see that? You see the time? It's time to build it, dude. Let's go. So the approach that I took when I reorganized the feed, I basically use YouTube like TV. So when I'm eating, I'll sit down, I'll turn on YouTube and I'll put on like a podcast episode. A crucial part of it for me was having like an over 30 minutes, basically like a long form section and a short form section. Sometimes I'm just bored and I wanna see a quick clip. Like I wanted there to be an over 30 minutes and an under 10 minutes. By the way, the screenshot of Bobby Lee going deep with Chad and JT, hilarious. I looked at what categories I had in my feed and I kept that in mind with the time constraint thing that I talked about as well. Like sometimes I wanna watch for an hour, sometimes I wanna watch like seven minute clips. So I have, so I went over 30 minute section with a horizontal scroll view. I have an MMA category that can be any length of videos, similar to how ESPN Plus has their sports in those other um, avenues of horizontal scrolls. I went favorite channels. So basically this could be where YouTube quickly recommends like your top channels. This is so you don't have to go to your subscriptions tab and scroll through all the way down. Say the one you wanna watch is, is letter, letter Z or are you got to scroll through all these subscriptions so for me i wanted there to be a quick like here's what you watch the most of there it is and then at the bottom we have our under 10 minute clips and um, it's just a random assortment using the algorithm now this is all sample data i did not go through youtube uh, json and parse it or any of that i just took some examples and I uh, hard coded them into this. So this is a small example of what I want it to look like. And you could keep going with categories in varying lengths and 
Maybe it even says full podcast episodes. Maybe it says comedy. Maybe it says sports. It kind of just depends on what your algorithm suggests for you. And this is, this is my example. Also, don't judge my videos, okay? I watch hilarious shit. I love comedians. I love MMA. Um, a lot of tech stuff as well. But love jujitsu. Love UFC. You see my top channels. Pat McAfee Show. Tim Dillon's hilarious. Love creator economics. Um, UFC. Gracie Ohio Jiu-Jitsu Academy. That's where I do jiu-jitsu. Uh, they have a great channel if you're into that. Nelk. Always hilarious. Tom Segura. Uh, but yeah, this is this is what... Just, you know, just an idea of what I thought I would enjoy my, my feed to look like this. So, uh, like I said, this is nothing, I, I'm well aware that this is not a crazy redesign. I just wanted to make some tweaks and I actually really enjoy the way the TV app is set up. I have a Samsung TV and the way I scroll through YouTube on there, I feel like that's better than how I scroll through on mobile. So, uh, let me know what you guys think of this video. I love doing stuff like this in SwiftUI. And I'm, I plan on doing more of them. I'm not going to stop doing tutorials, but this is more of the videos I'm interested in making because it's more creative and it allows me to uh, walk you through my process. So let me know in the comments uh, what you think of my redesign of YouTube, one. But also let me know if you guys want to see me design Facebook or Spotify or another app. I'm going to be uploading more videos like this. So... Give me the suggestions. Bring them on, all right? If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. It helps me. It, 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 it clobbers me with serotonin. It just knocks my lights out with serotonin, okay? So I want to feel that, all right? I need you to hit the thumbs up and I need you to subscribe because it helps me. It helps the channel. And um, I like getting feedback from you guys. So let me know what you think, seriously. And uh, reach out, comment, follow me. Uh, oh, yeah, follow my Instagram if you want to see shit like this. <laughs> uh, that was me at my friend's wedding, and I just posted that picture. So follow me on Instagram for great content like that. Like I said, let me know. Tell me in the comments what other apps. Did you love this? Did you hate it? I'm, I, 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 looking back, I would do a few things differently. Um, I kind of rushed through. I don't have the channel name under the videos, for example. Uh, I... Went back on my word after I totally bashed the casting button in the nav bar and then I put it there. I would probably do that differently and um, maybe I'll do the other pages in the next video, like the subscriptions tab and, you know, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, I have no plan here. I'm not much of a planning guy. So let me know what you guys want to see and I'll continue winging it. Thank you guys for watching. If you made it this far, that's incredible. Thank you. And I will see you next time.